hey guys so welcome back to the next uh video in our PySpark tutorial series at data with dominic today we're going to be looking at how to create a data frame manually so there's going to be two methods that we're looking at today one is to create a data frame directly from like python data types regular python data types and the other is to create an rdd from python data types and then create a data frame from an rdd so for this first method i've got this uh uh, variable data which is holding a list of dictionaries so dictionaries are basically a data type format where you can store key value pairs and in this instance I've got a list of dictionaries uh, with you can see we've got uni uniform uh, key keys uh, in all the dictionaries in the list so that would form or create the columns for us in our data frame so let's go ahead with the creation if you want to have access to this code i'm using i've created a repository with all the code i'm going to use and i'll link to that in the description and also i'm using pyspark for free in the databricks community edition so you can uh, watch my video which i'll link to in the top right corner of the screen to see how to set that up so let's begin with the demo so the first method is very uh, easy we just have to use the dot create data frame method so what we can do is we can just write data frame equal to spark dot create data frame and then mention the variable which is holding the data type that we want to confirm into a data frame so let's just run this first that's executed now let's run this that's executed so now let's confirm if data frame df has actually become a data frame so we do type df to check the type. Okay, we can see that it's a PySpark data frame. And let's just verify it by displaying the data frame. All right, so that looks good right now. So basically the next way which we can use to create a data frame is to create an RDD and then uh, work on that and make that a data frame. So as you can see, this data variable is still a list of dictionaries because the type is list. And to create an RDD from a Python data type, we just have to do RDD is equal to spark context or SC dot parallelize, all right? and then we pass the variable data. So once we run this, we can see that it's been executed. So if we check the type now of RDD, you can see that it's become a PySpark RDD. And for those asking what an RDD is, it's basically a, res a resilient distributed data set, which uh, allows us to sort of uh, work on tabular data uh, in a parallel with a parallel architecture current currently and still give the appearance that we're working with a single table of data so i'll i've got more on that in detail in my video about the PySpark architecture so i link to that in the top right corner of the screen you can check that out and now finally to convert getting back to the demo to convert this rdd to a data frame we're going to call it data frame 2 we just have to do an rdd pass the rdd variable with a 2df function commands been executed and now when we do a type df2 we see a PySpark data frame there and displaying the data frame you can see that we get the same data back all right guys so that was a little bit about creating a data frame manually in PySpark using the dot create data frame method and the dot 2df method uh, thank you guys for watching uh, we'll see you in the next video and don't forget to like subscribe share comment and hit the bell icon